Well, we have a new model from Microsoft known as 5.4. 5.4 is a 14 billion parameter state of the art model from Microsoft. In their technical report, we see that they are suggesting that this model has stronger reasoning and problem solving abilities. So we are going to test this model locally using Olama. But before that, let's go and have a look at this beautiful model. So this model is based on the Phi 3 architecture with 14.7 billion parameters. And this version that you're seeing inside Olama is quantized to four bit quantization. 5.4 is a 14 billion parameter state of the art open model built upon a blend of synthetic data sets, data from filtered public domain websites and acquired academic books and Q&A data sets. So we can see the capabilities of 5.4 in MMLU benchmark. We see that 5.4 stands somewhere near the 85%. Now other models is you know, you can see Quen 2.5 72 billion instruct, Llama 3.370 billion instruct. So it matches the performance of the large models such as Quen 2.5 and Llama 3.3. But again, these are large models, and on the x axis, you can see that the number of active parameters are in the range of 70 billion to 70 to 72 billion. But here we have just 14 billion parameters. Model uh, underwent a rigorous enhancement and alignment process incorporating both supervised fine tuning and DPO or direct preference optimization to ensure precise instruction adherence and robust safety measures. Now the context length is 16K. Anything greater than 16K in the input will not be read by this model. And you can see that average performance of the November 2024 AMC 10 and 12 test. So we are going to put some questions from this test itself. I have the AMC 10A opened here and we are going to test out a few problems here and test out how this model gives out uh, answers. Let, let us see. I don't know. But here we can see that 5.4 has the score of 91.8% and this blue color, this indigo color gives out the smaller models and the the light blue is are, are the larger models here and you can see that phi 4 stands on the top it stands at 91.8 percent accurate or average score now the use cases for this is designed to accelerate on language models for using as a building blocks for generative ai powered features okay so we have this technical paper here and in the technical paper you can see that this is the performance of various smaller models and various large models. So smaller models such as 5.4, 5.3, Quen 2.5, uh, 14 billion instruct, GPT-40 mini and large models such as Llama 3.3, Quen 2.5 and GPT-40. We don't know how many parameters but that's very large. So these are 70 billion plus instruct models here and you can see that for the simple evolves you can see that for gpqa 54 beats even gpt40 it beats quen it beats llama 3.3 on the math benchmarks as well it beats gpt40 but for the rest of the benchmarks it's not able to beat but again if you look at it's it's similar size models uh, when you compare it with quen 2.5 14 billion we get a good score. For example, here, human eval, MGSM, we can see a good score here. MMLU Pro, we can see a good score here. But what I am, what I have decided that I will use this model for is in the math and in the reasoning. So that will be a good use case for this model. So now let's go ahead and use this model using something known as Olama. I'm sure you know this already, but if not, it's okay. We're going to see this together. Now we have this system known as Olama.ai and that's basically a, a setup where using which you can run different large language models in your local system 
of course you can use this to run uh, your models in servers as well but since i'm on my windows i can go ahead to this windows here you have for mac os and you have for linux as well different set of intro instructions for the mac os you can um, install and download the setup file for the windows you can just click on download here and this will download the setup file now this is this uh, olama setup.exe you run this exe and get it installed and on the taskbar you can see that we have this olama running now once we have this olama running i can go to this model section here and look at the different models here so i'm going to click on newest maybe and let's see that we have this 54 so click on 54 and we have these instructions to download it's simple instructions to download it's just olama run 54 so let me go to a command prompt or you can say cmd here and inside the cmd what i'm going to do is first of all let's check if i have olama install so olama and i do have install and it's working fine so inside olama you have different available commands for example serve a model create a model from the model file show information for the model i have so many different videos on olama in this channel and you can go and have a look so what i'm going to do first and foremost is i'm going to list my models that are available in this system so i'm going to say olama list so this should give me the list of models that i have in my local system so i have 54 as well now in order to pull a model from the olama repository which is this repository here we need to run this command now before we run the olama run file which is this command here what i'm going to do is i'm going to pull a model from the repository or rep registry so i'm going to say i'm just going to clear this i'm going to say olama pull and 54 so this is going to pull the 54 model so this has been pulled well i already have this pulled therefore it's pretty fast but in your case we have this 9.1 gb file which will be downloaded to your local system you need to have space for that you need to have sufficient gpu uh, memory for running this so let's go and now run olama run 54 so i've started olama run 54 this is going to start up the model and set up everything so that we can punch in the question so send a message so give me uh, what is the capital of india basic question and we are going to go to the reasoning questions now so you can see the speed of course the speed is dependent on my system i have an 8 gb gpu system here therefore the speed if you have a higher system uh, with more gpus then you can expect this to be faster so i'm gonna go to this 2024 amc questions and this is what they have been advertising about that 54 is a very good model that it can solve different questions here so i'm gonna go to this first problem here and i'm gonna uh, give this question directly here so i'm just going to copy this so what is the value of this and then i'm going to go to the cmd and i'm just going to paste this as simple as that so i pressed enter and let's see its reasoning capability so it definitely will take some time because it's a reasoning it's a math problem and it's solving the math let's wait I will fast forward this or I can even leave this as it is so that you can see the actual speed of processing. So we have that the value of expression is box 2. If you go back and you can see that this is indeed the correct answer and 54 was able to pretty good it was able to solve this problem. The next problem is the problem number two so this is the problem i'm just going to copy this and i'm just going to paste it here and just gonna press enter and uh, now let's uh, as a matter of fact i have not read the question myself but i'm just going to test this out 
since we already have the answer here the answer is 246 let's see if this model can give us 246 as the answer which is the correct answer of course i'm not expecting a hundred percent you know accuracy but as they have said 90 to 95 percent accuracy is pretty good for a model like this okay it's taking some time but it's definitely i think is getting closer to the solution let's see it's okay it's a math problem it's a little tough but it is confident it seems thus the model estimates it will take around 246 minutes to get to the top and that is the correct answer i'm really impressed with this you know the first run that i did it was correct and for this video uncut edition you can see that this model works now i'm very happy with this model especially with its reasoning capabilities and i am now matured enough to not expect everything from a single model since i have a library of models i can choose which model to use for a particular purpose now for phi 4 i have decided that i'll use this for reasoning and problem solving abilities even on the math problem as well so having said that if you are enjoying this video please subscribe to this channel like this video share this video join my patreon hey because that helps me a lot and uh, i will see you in the next video go ahead and set it up using olama and i will see you in the next video please do mention if you face any problems during the installation and i'll be happy to show you it in a different video or in the comment section thank you have a nice day if you want to learn how to unlock the power of olama's structured json output check out this next video